welcome to it. Sorry my room is a mess, but that is because today we are packing for college. So just to quickly explain my living situation, so I am going to be a junior in college at Ball State University in Indiana, and I am currently living in a house with five girls total. And then I'm going to be moving into a different house, still on campus, just a different street with different people. And we'll have four girls living with us. So basically to be able to move between all these houses, I still need to pack everything up, and I do have a lot of new stuff like all the hats. Then I need to pack up and get ready to move between the two houses because I actually move on August 1st as when I have to move in. And then I'm leaving for California to go to visit my best friend Lauren who is a YouTuber and lives in California on August 2nd. So I literally have one day to do all this so I think that I really need to get it all packed up and ready before it even gets close to August 1st so that I'm not rushed and don't forget anything. So today I'm going to pack up some of the stuff here and actually bring it to to my college house because right now, sorry, I my living situation is so confusing. This house, this room is my parents' house. I have been living here for the summer just because I love family time and I get a lot of stuff done here. So I wanted to come back for the summer. So I need to move some of the stuff that's here to my college house, which is called Muncie. That's the town that it's in. So if you hear me say that, that's why. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully you can understand what we're doing here today. But each year I like to do something a little different. So I got a new bedspread, which I'm so excited about. It's from Urban Outfitters. It's pink. Then I have all this stuff that I got on Amazon Prime Day that needs to go over to my college house. And then eventually I will get to all of my clothes, but I need to do my laundry. And yeah, I don't know. Most of the stuff will be last minute stuff. Like I'm not gonna bring my iMac just yet because I obviously use that every day here. <laughs> this bath mat and pillow also need to go to my college. So I had just got this pillow in the mail like maybe yesterday or two days ago and Murphy, this is my dog Murphy, he thinks it is his. Like as I was carrying it out here, he's like staring up at it. Like that TikTok that was like, what are you doing with my stuff? <laughs> okay, car is packed, have it all back there and then we will be on our way to my college town. Okay, just got back to my college house. Oh, my hair, okay. I had to rush and upload my video. It was like 11.47 when we pulled in and my videos normally post at noon and I hadn't even uploaded it yet so I was trying to get it up really quickly. I was really counting on the fast Wi-Fi here because our Wi-Fi is really fast so it did end up uploading. I think it was maybe like a minute late but that's okay, I'll take it. So for the last like 40, no, hour, last hour I've been responding to comments and doing all that and linking everything so now it's finally time to get to work and start packing up stuff. Also, nobody is home right now. So I have the whole house myself, so I'm going to take advantage of that because my room's kind of small and it'd be hard to pack stuff up in there, so yeah. Also, it's still decorated from Kylie's birthday party. Okay, so here is the status of my room. Um, a little cluttered. I know for sure today I want to take down my desk and bring that back home because I think my younger sister Sarah is going to take this one and I'm gonna get a new one next year because this one's just not big enough for my iMac and everything that I need to do. So we're gonna pack up the drawers and take those out so that I can transport that easily. And there's so much stuff underneath this bed, like shoved under there that I don't even know how to deal with that. So we've got a lot to do today. But I think it'd be easiest to do with the desk first. So I'm gonna unpack it and put all the stuff in these little drawers so that I can take that down and put it in the car so we have room to do more today. As I am finding things that I don't really want anymore and just want to give away to like my younger sisters or something, I'm just going to throw it in this bag and then just hand it to them. So, starting off like this purse. I'm starting to declutter my life, I guess. So, I'm going to be doing that 
as I'm going through things. So I just um, had some glass break in my room the other night and I thought I swept it out all of my rug but obviously I didn't because I just stepped on the tiniest little piece and my foot is bleeding like crazy, like dripping on the floor. It somehow got in my hand, I don't know. So originally we were going to keep this rug for next year, but now I think I just need to throw it away because I can't even see all these glass pieces and if one literally like tiny, like it literally looked like a speck of dust was in my foot, I do not want to get anyone hurt next year. So like it's like dripping, that's so gross. <laughs> This is disgusting, so I'm going to quickly wipe off these shelves because they're so gross. Well, I could not figure out how to take the desk back apart, so I'm going to try and fit it in my Jeep. I'm not sure if it's going to fit. I'm going to try and go squeeze it in there. I'm a little nervous though because there's so many people outside like working on the houses around me. It's going to be so embarrassing watching me try and fit this in my Jeep. So we'll see how this goes. Stop. Okay, I'm going to take a break and go get some food. I have not eaten anything other than a bagel today and it's so hot outside and I'm lifting all the stuff into my car so I need to get some food in me. So let's go grab food and maybe even some coffee. I don't know. Oh wait, just kidding. We don't need to go anywhere. I have food. Oh my, our laundry room is crazy. I'm going to take my suitcase. Oh gosh. For when I go to California, I'm gonna need that, so I'm just gonna bring it now home. All right, I'm ready to get back on into this, but really quick, I thought this would be a great spot to talk about today's video sponsor, which is Prime Student. Basically, Prime Student is kind of like a one-stop shop for all of your college or school needs, so they have stuff from bedding and decor to supplies, so much that can just be delivered right to your door so quickly and affordably. If you didn't know, college students can actually get a six-month trial of Prime Student at no cost, and then after that, it is half off, which is amazing, a regular Prime membership, which is actually what I have right now. So like I said, you can shop all of your college essentials and receive fast and free shipping with Prime Student. Prime Student also does give students the best deals on Prime. There are just so many great things about Prime Student that I love, so let me show you what I've gotten from their back to school page lately. All for my room next year that I'm going to be moving into. That is why we are packing everything up right now. The first thing is this Honeywell fan. I love it. I actually don't have AC in my room. I'll have a ceiling fan and it doesn't work very well. So this is a must have for me. I also just like to keep my room cold so it's perfect especially for next year. I'm very excited. It also like rotates around the room which I love. Is this wall mount so it's going to hold my purses and my coats. I think this is great because I can just put it in my closet or hang it up behind my door or something and just have somewhere nice looking to hang up all of my stuff. Then I also wanted some nice new towels because my ones I've had for a couple years now and they're getting a little worn out so I wanted some new ones for the new school year so these perfect white ones ones from the Amazon Basics are amazing. The next thing is this beautiful fake eucalyptus that I'm going to hang as a decoration and I definitely cannot keep real plants alive so this is a perfect alternative for me. Next is this accessory stand. Look at how pretty it is. So this is going to sit on top of my desk or somewhere in my closet and I'm going to hang my necklaces and bracelets and stuff and my earrings. Right now my current situation, let me show you, is so janky and bad so would not recommend. That's why I need that new stand. And then these curtain string lights I'm so excited about. I think they'll be super cute maybe behind my bed or behind my desk. I'm not quite sure what I do want to do with these yet. Maybe put them in my living room. I don't know but here's a picture of what they look like. I just think they're so cute. And I also got a new bed frame and I just haven't been able to set it up yet because I'm waiting until I get to move in. But it basically just looks just like this one which I also got from Amazon just with light wood because I wanted to switch to light wood. And here's what it looks like. I am very pumped and excited to set that up once I move in but I can't move in yet because we don't have access 
keys to the house. <laughs> Anyways, don't forget to go click the link below to start your six month trial of Prime Student. And I will also have all these products linked below for you to shop from as well. <laughs> So I have all these snacks that have literally been up there since the day I moved in, so time to throw those out. So this whole time I had a bunch of boxes stuffed under here because Luna would like go under here and like not come out ever. So look at this whole like graveyard of all her toys down there. It is so funny. My best two moving hacks that I've ever seen are to do this thing with the trash bags with your clothing hangers so then that way when you go back to hang them back up in the closet, you just hang it up and then you just cut the bag off and it's so easy and convenient when you're just moving between two different closets. And then the other one which I already did is to tape the side of your drawer to the back of it kind of, just like put a little piece of tape around the edge so that when you're moving the big tower of drawers like that one and this one, the drawers aren't like sliding out as you're trying to walk so that's another tip is to just put a little piece of tape like right there and there. I did not realize how much stuff I had in this room, but I've gotten it mostly packed up so all those drawers over there are packed up, which is good. So I will just take those drawers out when we're moving them, I'm not going to do it right now. So it's just easier to carry the whole thing itself. But yeah, all of this stuff I can basically just load into the car, take it to my other house, and then just unpack it all, which is great. That's all I really needed. There's maybe a couple like last minute things like my iMac and all that stuff at my parents' house that I will definitely bring on moving day. When I pour my cup, when it's on high, do it my cup on an empty, no worry, there's always more to pour from the pure tea drunk, tea drunk, the in the knee. Tea drunk, tea drunk, the in the knee. I think I'm just gonna throw these away. There's no way that I can transport these to my next room. But they didn't take any paint off, which is good. Then there are also some that went up there and down and around my bed, so I just took it and I just continued it along the downside of my bed so that there's like a fun little light from the back of the headboard, so I'll just leave those ones on there. Okay, the other only things that I still need to do are throw out this little table because it's broken, find somewhere to put that, and then pack up all my alcohol and something, but I ran out of boxes. So I'm gonna do that probably the day that I move out. It's so bittersweet, but I'm so excited to move into my next room. So thank you guys for helping me pack. Now I just need to pack up my car with the stuff that I'm bringing back to my parents' house just to keep there because I don't need all of this here in Muncie with me. Like I'm not even gonna use it at my next house. So I got my desk in the car, but then I have these other bags. But this is where this video is going to end. Thank you guys so much for helping me pack. Hope it was satisfying and you loved coming along. Get excited for lots more back to school videos. I have so many coming, so get ready. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video.